Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. If y'all read the title below, I'm just giving y'all a little life update, like how I'm feeling, where my head at, cause y'all, I just don't know. Like, I just don't know. So, yeah. We'll get into the video after the intro. Okay, y'all. So now that y'all are back, y'all yeah, just be. I'm just keep this shit so honey with y'all. It's really about school. Like school is so fucking draining, and I feel like I'm really fighting with school and YouTube because YouTube is something that I'm passionate about. But I was always told like I always have a backup plan. Which is cool. I'll do that. I have two, three, four, five backup plans, but YouTube is something I really want to do. So, school wise, what's going on now is the teacher that I have for sleep tech, well, the man teacher, it's the man teacher and a woman teacher that we go to on ground campus. So, the man teacher, 10 out of 10. Like, if y'all get into sleep tech going to Concord, the male teacher is amazing. Now, the female teacher that's teaching anatomy, trash as fuck, y'all. Let me tell y'all why she's trash as fuck. So, when we first get into the class, like, she's always late. Like I said, one, she's always late. Two, when she get in, she, okay, let me tell y'all. Tell me if I'm going crazy or if I'm tripping or what should I do in these scenario situations. Because I have done some shit within these situations, but I don't know if it's really effective at the moment. So, yeah, like I was saying, she's an hour late. She come in with these little bitty ass outfits on. I don't know who the hell she trying to impress. And she's probably like 50, 60 Probably younger, probably younger. I don't know. But I'm going to just go with 50, 60 because that's what she's giving. So, not only that, she have us. Okay, when somebody is lecturing, I feel like as a professor, you shouldn't even be reading off the screen. I feel like if you know the material and you done went to school for it, you done got your PhD on it, why the fuck are you reading off the screen? You should know this shit, like, off the back of your hand. That's just like with any assignments that we have to do and we have to present out to the class. We should already know what the hell the assignment is about front and back. We shouldn't even be looking at the screen. We should break this shit down in our own words. Everybody can read the screen. But that's what she do. She reads to us. You're not breaking shit down. You're not technically teaching us. You're reading to us. I can read the screen my damn self. So not only that, while she's lecturing y'all, she have us doing these timed assignments. So imagine you're sitting in the class. The teacher is lecturing, but she's telling you to finish this worksheet. And keep in mind, we haven't learned shit on the worksheet. We haven't learned shit on these worksheets, so we have to guess or use Google probably. So we're trying to hurry up and finish the worksheet. She's already deep into the lesson. She's probably 30 slides in on the damn screen. Meanwhile, half of us ain't even... We still working on the fucking assignment that is timed. So how the fuck do you do that? Where the fuck do they do that shit at, y'all? Like... I've never seen no shit like that before, and, and it's sad because our education system, they're already trying to take that away from us, and here it is, you not even trying to teach, you just here to get a check. Like, that's fucked up. So, not only that, y'all, so, she's coming in late, got these little ass outfits on, you're lecturing us while giving us assignment, oh, mind you. The, the time the assignments that we have to do, she's not even grading them. She's having us turning in the assignments. And that's it. So, I kind of bust her out. Like, I ain't even going to say bust her out. I asked a question. She got an attitude. Whatever. I said, you know, Miss So-and-so, um, 
I see we didn't turn in over 10 assignments throughout these last past couple of weeks. Are we getting grades for these? Like, because if not, fuck the assignments. I could be taking notes for this damn lecture that you're reading to us. She was like, uh, no, the assignments is just to show that you know what you're doing. So we're sending the assignments to your inbox to make it seem like we know what we're doing. But in reality, we don't know what the fuck we're doing. Hmm. Baby, they just find anybody out fucking indeed, Craigslist, list. Like, baby. And I feel like Concord really have to do better in picking these fucking teachers because what the fuck? So after that, um, another thing that goes on, she come in late. Like I said, y'all, this three cap. She come in late, little ass short song. Lecturing and giving us time assignments. The assignments are not timed. The assignments, no, not the assignments are not timed. The assignments that we turn in are not graded. It's not graded. Then you have the nerve to, while we're doing more classwork that you're not grading, she gets on the phone with her homeboy, her home, home girl, give relationship advice, planning girls trip trying to figure out what hotel to book and then you have them on speaker so we can hear everything they're saying they cussing up a storm on speaker and i feel like that shit is so fucking unprofessional like you must got your degree out the fucking cereal box or something because that, that shit is so fucking unprofessional and so um yeah, she have the people all on the phone and shit. Like, like, baby, that, that shit is crazy. It's one, y'all, I bullshit y'all night. It was one night where she was literally on the phone. Then there the whole majority of the class. We haven't learned shit. She haven't lectured shit or nothing. So I'm like... I'm finna go. Like, I'm finna go. Like, you got me so fucked up because you gotta realize people have jobs, people have kids, and we still manage to come to school just for you to sit here, sit in here and play in our face, pretty much. Like, I could be at home chilling, cooking, cleaning, doing, catching up on work, like getting ahead of my other classes. But here it is, you bullshitting us. Like, that shit is so insane. So, y'all, I done went to the dean. Come to find out the dean is cool with the teacher. So, now she got her ass on her shoulders because she knows somebody went back and told the dean what's going on. Now, she's upset with the whole class. Like, so now, y'all, we got 10 weeks in term one. We are currently on week nine. Like I said, week 10 is the end of the first term, first semester, whatever. So, with all the knowledge that y'all know now, bitch ain't taught us shit. Ain't taught us nothing. She claimed in like, what, week eight? Week seven, week eight, we'll have an open book exam. Okay, because baby, that's going to be the only way I pass. Because keep in mind, a lot of people in the classroom isn't really passing. If they are passing, it's barely so it's because we got these assignments and the assignments pretty much go based off what she's teaching but she's not teaching shit so the grades aren't really giving but yeah now like i said we're in week nine and she she got her ass on her shoulder so she came in and was like yeah so uh now we're not gonna have open book exam like she got mad and she took that option away from us. So now, we, week 10 is the exam. Next week is the exam, y'all. So, yeah, a lot of us, majority of us might fail this class. And it's kind of fucked up because you haven't talked shit. You've been on the phone most of the time. Hmm. And it's crazy, y'all, because I didn't went to the dean. I didn't went to talk to the president of Concord. Like, she's a terrible representation of Concord. Like, 
she gotta go. Like, somebody gotta get rid of her, fire her, something. I don't know. But, no. So, that's where we at, y'all. Next week, Wednesday. Next week, Wednesday, um, yeah, we should have everything turned in. So, it's a possibility that majority of the other class might have to take her class over. But, um, yeah, she need to be fired. So, like I said, it's kind of mentally draining, y'all. Because it's like, I've been fighting so hard for the class. Probably me and maybe one more other person. But, it's on so much my voice can do. Because I'm a very outspoken person. Well, I try to be anyway, but... It's on so much I can do alone. And I told the rest of the class, y'all need to speak up and say something. Because now, we might have to take this fucking class again. And I, uh-uh. Mm-mm. I can't do it. So, yeah. That's the problem that I have at hand, y'all. Like I said, I try to be transparent. Tell y'all what the fuck going on. So far, school is interesting. The sleep part, the actual hands-on shit. But anatomy... No, like this shit going left, like it's going south, and she, the lady teacher, got an attitude, and no, like this lady is ghetto as fuck. Like she, she need to go, and I hope Concord hears me out, cause I didn't email so many people telling them what's going on. I ain't got pictures of, the, of this lady, videos of her on the phone and shit, like. For a long ass period of time, not getting off the phone, not trying to teach the class, like y'all, a motherfucker tired of fighting behind the scenes and shit. And ain't nobody else saying shit, doing shit or nothing. So that's where I'm at, y'all. School currently sucks for me, and it's like I told some of the girls, cause our classroom got like our own little group chat. I told some of the girls, shit, this shit make me really just want to quit, but I know it's a bigger purpose. Like, I, I got a bigger purpose or whatever. Granted, I'm in school. But this is not something I see myself doing in the future. YouTube definitely is. This shit, I feel like I'm just doing this shit for a time to go by, you know. So. But, yeah, that was, a lot of the girls was encouraging me. Talking about don't quit, don't quit. We got this. We just got to get through it and da, 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 da. It's cool, but oh, it's so fucking draining. And she's, oh, she's getting on my fucking nerves, y'all. Oh, my God. So. <sighs> so, all I can do is finish up the work that I do have and just study as much as I can and try to memorize everything and just try to pass. But, honestly, the odds, the odds are pretty much against me. Like, y'all, oh, my God. Yeah, I just don't understand. This shit is so fucking stressful. So stressful. And when a motherfucker asks her questions, she get attitude. Or if we had a... We had, okay. Some of our discussions that we have online, we have to read aloud. She be trying to bash our work too sometimes. Like, I think I made a... Wrote a paper on ALS and shit. And I thought that was a very good um, topic. But um, everybody else did different ones and stuff. So then she kind of said something to the class to mess up. Yeah, all these papers are pretty much basic. And da 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 da. And y'all yeah, gotta do better. Y'all need to uh, pick some better conditions and stuff. I'm like, bitch, ALS is very fucking important. So I feel like I did a damn good job on my paper. I don't know what the hell you talking about. Like, shit like that, you nitpicking, man. Then when somebody get in your ass, now you're going to feel some type of way. Because it's like she's very immature for you to be 60, 70, 80 years old. Like, and there you got some there coming in with some booty shorts on. Like, who are you trying to impress? But I know this is some guys coming into the classroom, so I see what you're trying to do. I guess you're still trying to show that you still got it or something, Grandma. I don't know. But, y'all, I'm over it. So, just pray for me, y'all. I'm going to try to get through this school shit. I feel like if I could just get through her class, I'll be okay. 
everything else pretty much smooth sailing. So, but yeah, that's all. That's what the fuck been going on. So, y'all, just stay tuned. And I'm going to keep y'all posted and keep y'all updated. Hopefully, the president say something. Director of operations. I just spoke to some of the deans. Hey, I'm going to just keep y'all updated. So, shit. But, yeah, y'all. That's pretty much it. So, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on y'all post notification bells. And keep y'all posted. Bye. Baby, can you focus on me?